Yo, what's going on, boys? Episode four of the Bronze to Masters series. My enemy passed all of his bands. Let me just show you. I think the face came away. He passed all of his bands. So uh, we're going to try some try hard stuff against him today because I assume you pass all that band, all your bands, you mean business. And not only do you mean business, but you mean intense, very try hard business. And don't you worry, we're going to be try harding from here on out pretty much because, oh, that's Giannis. Because <clears throat> I have 2250 MMR. And 2250 MMR means the big boys are starting to come out. So if I am ever lower MMR, I got to make sure that I really am trying my hardest because um, it's very easy for you to lose when you are caught off guard. You know, like um, I'm trying to think like that Hades game that I played against the... Who was it? I believe it was... I'm not actually going to back. You don't get the speed boost in this map, so it's kind of shitty. But... Who did I fight a Hades was? No, I was fighting a Hades. Wasn't I? And I was... Kronos, I think. He just warded. So I'm starting, um, I'm starting tier two trans reason being because I don't want to give away that I'm going animosity just yet. Ouch. All right, he definitely does not win this fight. Okay, I missed all my autos, but it didn't matter. He left the game, bro. <laughs> okay, well, look, I have to show this video. I have to show this game because if I don't, people are going to say that this whole speed run is fake or the whole series is fake. Um, so I have to show it, but this is going to be a pretty lame two more minutes. So I apologize for that. But, you know, it's honestly like things like this are kind of expected to happen because especially I like I'm assuming he's super tilted because he probably passed all his bands, not because he was going to play something super OP, but instead because he has been fighting stuff that is super OP and he was just kind of sick of it. Um, if I had to guess, it was definitely the second one and he's just on tilt, but I mean, Hey, it happens to the best of us it happens to everyone. So unfortunately it is what it is. All right. We are just. Trying to push down. I just want to see if I can get Phoenix by like blind push before um what is it before the game auto ends? Because after they leave the game, the the game should auto end in two minutes. I think he left at like 115 or something like that, so we got about another minute to see if we can get Phoenix. One more wave should be able to do it. Question is, will one more wave get here before the game end? No, it won't. Damn it, dude. All right. Well, <laughs> I'll see you guys in game number two. Uh, I'll show the stats though first. Like how much TP and MMR and should I get? It says defeat, but it, it always says defeat when they leave the game. I don't know why, but it will count as a win. Don't worry. So 73 MMR, 38 TP. I'll actually promo in one game. So this is only going to be a two game episode. Well, I don't know. We'll see. Maybe I'll go two promos in this episode. We'll see. Anyways, I'll see you next game. 
Welcome back, gamers, to game number two. I'm playing Hoi. I'm fighting a Danza Bro. This should be a good game. Should be a good game. I did have higher MMR. He did ban. Don't worry. Hm. Game is too calm for you. All right. Well, we'll see, dude. We'll see just how calm you are. I really don't want that. I want Ascendance. And we're going to go one of these, one of these. I'm not going to go Mana Pot. The blue stone gives me no mana, so I'm going to sell this and go mana pot. And I will go Agus. Why am I going Agus? Because when he uses his rocket, <clears throat> even if I jump perfectly, which hopefully I do, uh, it could still hit you. So we'll see how this game goes. I haven't played this matchup very often. In fact, I haven't played Hoi very often. But, uh... I Minions have spawned. Well, that's not good. But I uh, I do hope this is gonna be good. I'm at an extreme disadvantage. Never mind. It was easy to keep track of where he was in his, uh, in his, I guess, leaf there. Uh, pretty much just because you just, you basically just track where he goes. I don't know. I don't, there's no real secret. Oh, Jesus. Sorry. Mm. Mm. Sorry about that, boys. <clears throat> I'm doing quite a bit of damage to him. Blue stone is nice. I think mannequins is very, very strong, but <clears throat> I do really like blue stone here. We have him playing extremely defensive, which is really nice for me. Really, 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 really nice for me, actually. This is the first time I played Hoi in this account. So, that's nice. But I do want to keep switching up the gods I play. I don't just want to get masters with one god. Even though I could do it much faster than I am right now. It's okay. Okay, it's okay. Um uh, thought he would juke the other direction. Nice. Okay. I'm actually very surprised he uh he shelled that. Oh, it didn't bounce the third time. That's alright. We go get Transcendence now. It is kind of risky here to go Transcendence before finishing Boots, and he's doing the same thing, actually. Um, which, like I said, is it's very risky. The reason it's risky is because if he goes Boots... Like, so right now, I mean, it's not risky because he's we're both committing to Transcendence, but... For instance, if you were to go Boots, uh, I'm at an extreme disadvantage for the beginning. Because he's going to have all that attack speed or all that extra power just immediately. Whereas I'm going to have to slowly build mine up by getting stacks on Transcendence. Alright, well I just missed the big minion completely. Your middle tower is under attack. Probably not the best play. Where is he? Probably just doing his buffs, honestly. All right, so far so good. Nothing new here. Oh, so close. So close. Nice. Let's go, dude. Let's go. Um, Hoi was out on this map, by the way, when the map first came out. 
uh in case you're wondering how i know all these bounces by heart um uh, it's because i have so much experience with hoya on this map i used to play him quite a bit back in the day All right, and that might secure the victory for us right there, honestly. I think three kills is kind of the turning point. Like, I, I don't think there's a lot. I don't think there's a lot you can do. I'm hitting some nice bounces. I'm uh, My positioning is just very good in general right now. I don't really know if there's much you could do here. But, I mean, we'll see. I don't know. in that direction okay. your middle tower is under attack here it comes. let's just go boots here um i'm gonna go cool down or not cool down tax speed boots and i'm happy about this game dude i actually am like i know you guys might think it's it's kind of cheap right like because i'm just i'm bragging so hard and it's weird that an episode of bronze to master series might be shortle the shortle <laughs> squirtle but short might be shorter than like a normal one game video but i don't know i mean sometimes it just happens and like i said in uh, a previous episode sometimes like Sometimes you just expect it, you know what I mean? Sometimes you just gotta expect it. And it's not like you can do anything about it. It's just... I don't know. This is what it is. Am I in borderless? I am. I play in borderless window, by the way. Just so I can tab out and like do stuff easier. Uh, I do still win this fight, by the way. Assuming I hit any auto ever. Because my auto's hit like 16 times harder than his. Oh, I'm. I. I tried Aegising. <clears throat> I tried Aegising, but it didn't go off. Maybe it's because I was just a little late on the Aegis. That might be it. Who knows? I think Blink here is going to be super good. I'm going to go Exe. <clears throat> Aussie is definitely better here, but I, I just want the immediate power spike of Exe. And I, I do still stand by the fact that I win that fight, by the way. The only problem is that I missed everything. I didn't miss. That fight would have been sick. Oh. So I can blink on him here and guarantee a kill. But I don't think killing him here actually does anything for me. Yeah, I mean, killing him doesn't really do anything for me. He respawns so fast. Alright, line it up. Hmm. All right, now we go breastplate. Uh, Midgard is better here. Good choice. Midgard is better, but actually, maybe breastplate's not bad. I do need to go itch of all like he's going right now, but I have time. And the reason I didn't blink on him for that kill was because one, like I said, you don't really get anything from it. I got secure the red buff, but I, I think I get that regardless. But two, he already cleared my wave. There really wasn't like much to do I've got my all right but here here is when getting a kill on him is actually really important i will be blinking on him shortly because i will have enhanced red buff 
I will have enhanced red buff and doing quite a bit of damage to the tower. So I wait for my minions to get about halfway so that I have enough time and then I uh, I full commit. And I want to be slightly pressuring so that he doesn't back and finish Ridge Ball because then, you know, obviously the fight could go either direction. Alright, perfect. As soon as minions came close enough, I went full aggro. And uh, with my full-on aggression, we get the Phoenix. And that is game and also a promotion, more than likely, into Diamond 5. Uh, should we do a second promotion in this one episode? That was only a 19-minute recording. In plat one? I didn't even skip. I didn't even skip. Okay, we're absolutely doing another promotion. Absolutely. I'm not uploading a 15 minute video that doesn't even get me into diamond. I will be back. What's up, boys? Game number whatever. Um, <clears throat> I know I was going to do one promotion per video, but I didn't want a, a 15 minute video to just like chill and do nothing it just seems really lame to me so we're gonna to we're gonna get two promotions in this video two of them and it'll be sick no matter what sick no matter what and i'm playing chiron this game why am i playing chiron yeah i think he's good um <clears throat> excuse me with the blue stone change and the transcendence being buffed <clears throat> he's definitely better to play he's he's easier to play for sure let me see if this guy comes over to this red i did just fight this guy so maybe he knows okay Perfect. Perfect. We got first blood, baby. He did know. He definitely knew my plan to get the red buff. But uh, he thought he won the fight. And you definitely don't win the fight. Kronos early game is not good. Even with shell. Even with the fighting relic where I only have... Like, I only have beads, right? And I suck. I miss so much. <laughs> it's okay, though. Ouch. Mm. I maybe could kill here. We're just going to do that, though. We're just going to super push the wave. I'm going to go back and get boots. Not my usual, but nice. <clears throat> I am okay with this position on the field. Why am I okay with this position? Uh, because I, I have a lot of pressure right here. I have a lot of pressure on the map. He's going to go get his speed buff. But um, he'll have two buffs. And he's not really in a position to fight me because I just backed and got, you know, some increases. So I'm in a good position to just keep my control. Very, very solid. Very solid all around. Almost like a chess game, you know what I mean? It's almost like I'm playing chess where I'm just sitting here. And I'm not really doing much, but I'm improving my position. One move after one move after one move. That's really what I'm doing. And alting that wave... It was kind of like, kind of like a bishop sack, you know. I, I, it didn't really do much in the in the the moment, but it leads me to a very very nice end game, where I'm ahead in all regards. All 
uh, he definitely is gonna ult this. Oh, died to archers. Thank you, archers. I beads the uh, I beads the stun, but I guess I didn't have to actually. Archers had my back there. Archers were being uh, were broing out for me. I really appreciate that. All right, so now we are up two kills and four buffs, and it is looking extremely nice for me. Extremely nice for me here in this position. I hope I skip in the diamond four, by the way, because I didn't skip in my last promo. I went from plat two to plat one, which is just Omega lame. But um, I hope I skip in the diamond four. That'd be nice. All right. This is really nice, dude. I, I feel like I am definitely in control of this game right here. I feel very in control. And this is going to be a red buff for me. Oh, what's that over there? That's cool as shit. I want that sword. Is that Excalibur? I think it might be Excalibur. I think Arthur's probably pissed. You know what would be a cool little Easter egg? Hold on, I'm done. I'm getting butt fucked right now. Getting butt fucked would not be a cool Easter egg, by the way. That's not what I meant. I'm dead. Okay. Got a full ring, huh? All right. I'm comfortable with ulting the wave. I don't think my ult has much value right now. I don't have much power, so... Well, now I do. I just finished my transcendence, so now we have a lot of power, but... Beforehand, I didn't. Alright, so we are going to do a lot of damage. If I hit abilities, it's going to do a lot. And look at that, dude. One auto, and or two autos, and... A two and he's half HP. Jeez. That's gonna hit hard. 300 damage? Oh my gosh. Alright. And this is 100% gonna be the tower down. My one hit him? My one did hit him. Damn, I hit him with an auto, a one, and a two, and he died. Holy shit. That's insane. I did not think that was killing. I did not think he dies there. Gosh, that's insane. That blows my mind, man. Chronos, or Chiron does so much damage. No wonder he's so high up there on... Uh, Picks right now in conquest. Mind your footing. Yeah. Oop, I just out a wall. <clears throat> What's my next item gonna be here? Could be a shogun's. I actually think shogun's would be pretty nice. Doesn't give me HP, but I'm not building animosity. HP is nice, but not needed when you're not building animosity what does it give it gives good mana right mp5 cooldown 60 protection yeah i mean that's pretty nice Oh. Oh. 
Nice, dude. I actually nice. Actually nice. I'm not mad. That's actually really nice. I changed my mind. I'm gonna go into Toxic Blade. I used my uh What's it called? I used my it's called training exercise. I used my one and I got CC immunity on his stun and I thought that would be enough. But uh I underestimated the size of his shell. And he he got me with it. I mean, what can I say? I'm impressed. Good job. I really want some sort of sustain. definitely heals a lot which does not make this easy I do a lot of damage though but is it enough to do a little bit more there but I guess I couldn't I mean he does have defense so oh that hit me oh yikes dude Oh, nice. Okay. I lived. Yikes. 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 Scary. Grab the Shoguns. That gives me more attack speed. Pestilence could be nice. He does have so much healing, but... I don't know. Maybe I'll just go Beat Stick. Second Enhanced Red just spawned. I want to make sure that I get it. I might not be able to. Oh, but I am. I really, uh... Really expected him to be here, actually. My next item is going to be an Aussie one trillion percent of the time. Okay, that's super awkward. I am faster than him. Very nice. And that is game. Awesome. I don't know why I have no sound. That's weird that I have no sound right there, but that's okay because that's game. Let's see what the TP slash MMR says. Plus 37. We are now at 2.4k MMR. That is pretty good, dude. That's pretty good. All right. Well, <clears throat> I'll see you guys in the next game. Until then. What's up, boys? Game number four of the episode, I think. Game number five, maybe? I'm actually not sure. I've played a lot of games today. I've recorded quite quite a bit today. <laughs> so I'm not really sure exactly, exactly where I'm at, but... Let's just act like I know and let's go uh let's go mannequin transcendence. I do like bluestone quite a bit, but um I, I yeah, I'm gonna go bluestone. I talked myself into it. And we go beads and I do this. And then we race our way over to the red buff and see if we can 
See, we not only are fighting, because, you know, the higher MMR I get, the more people seem to want this red buff rather than their blue buff. I dare you to sneak up on so I'm seeing if, uh, if we're fighting, and if we are, will I win the fight? Okay, the reason I jumped, by the way, was to make sure I could see if he was coming. And I could kill here, by the way, because he's going to come this way and try to get red. So I'm going to camp here a little bit. Okay, I'm ugly. Never mind. I thought I was cool, but it, in fact, I am ugly. Holy shit, I do a lot of damage. He got very close to dying there. Oh my goodness. I'm okay with him poking me. I don't mind it at all. So basically what happened here was he's been spamming trying to like win the fight whereas I know I win the fight all right perfect perfect all right, exactly what I wanted. I wanted him to invade me, and I wanted him to think that he could kill. And uh, we got we got exactly what we wanted. Very very nice. And now we are going for the four buff control that seems to be uh, what I go for every game. There's some you know there's some games where I can maybe push for a five buff control. And some when I'm stomping and can even go for six, but in general, I like to just try to maintain four. I think four buff control is sick. Super good. Alright. Um, he's probably going to go Boombas or Animosity. Just judging by him not having a, a starter yet. He's going for this speed. I would like to stop him. Oh, I'm dead as shit here. Yeah. I missed the two. That was pathetically horrible. That was like that was like a joke, dude. That was actually a joke. But I missed that. Damn. I feel really bad about that fight. I feel quite bad about that fight. Oh, let's try again and uh hopefully this time it goes better. <laughs> All right. He won't have alt this time though, which is actually super nice. Hmm. What's he doing? I actually have five buff control this game, and I was just talking about sometimes getting five buff control. I was doing blue. It seems weird that when you're doing so good fighting that you would give up a red buff. That was just very good. Just very good gameplay there.
All right. He loses some minions. He died and lost some XP. They should fear me now. Really nice. I don't know if there's much more here to talk about other than this comes down to just fighting. He's doing pretty good. Like I said, I'm at 2.4k MMR now. It's not a uh, not amateur hour anymore. Or maybe it is. I don't know. It's definitely not amateur hour. I just think like his build is pretty bad. I don't know why. Why would you go demonic that early in a build when I have no defense? Doesn't really make a lot of sense to me. All right, all down. All right. He's trying to fight me with this build of his when it really just is not the correct build. Like, if you want to fight, you got to go like Mannequins, Boots, Bancrofts. You can't go Demonic. You can't go no starter, starter item. You're just not going to win the fight. Not going to have enough early damage. But GG. And of course, we see the stats before I go to the next thing. 77 TP. 2444 MMR. One more game until we're in Diamond, boys. I'll see you there. Yo, what is up, boys? Last game of the episode. Hopefully, unless I lose... This guy is higher MMR than me. I have 2.4K and he already is higher. And we're going to be playing Oleron. Let's game, dude. Let's game. I know this fellow. And I very much dislike this fellow. Uh, let's do this and this and this and this. And we will go... We'll go beads. I think beads is the play. I, I just like beads in general. You know what I mean? Let's game. This is a big fucking rock. Is this rock bigger than the other one? Because it really feels like this rock is bigger than the other one. This rock seems real big. By the way, my plan is uh, animosity this game. I'm going to go animosity. All right. He basically died for no reason there. He took so much damage. Oh my gosh. And I know he's also going to go animosity, by the way. Because, I mean, that's just the best way to play out Kwong. All right. Very fast clear. Oh, my gosh. Did he back or did he do this? Yeah, he backed. Backed. We're in a good spot. I mean, I don't have much mana to fight with, but we am level five. Oh, just an insane kill. Holy. He left the game. Come on, man. <laughs> I really, really, I, look, I don't use the word hate often, but that man is, uh, is very, very much disliked by me and my fiance. And he said some disgusting things to me and her. So completely dumpstering him. He's like, let me put it this way. He's like my number one hater or my number two hater. 
He's probably my number two hater. And, uh, it feels good. It, fe it feels good to end out the video like that. It's, you know what's funny too is the video started like this too. The first game of the video was somebody leaving the game after I killed them. <laughs> That's super funny. Alright, well. Now I guess I can just talk about whatever I want for the next two minutes. Because uh, this was a double promotion video. A five game... A five game episode. Where we fought actually a GM player and made him quit in a minute. Pretty good stuff, dude. Pretty good stuff. I wish I was playing this match on my main account because it would have given me an extra probably 30, 20 or 30 MMR, but you know. Gotta do what I gotta do while I'm in platinum, I guess. <laughs> Um, why am I backing? Great question. I have no idea. Literally, there's no point because the game is going to end very shortly. Um, yeah. Let's see if we get Diamond 5 or Diamond 4. I have 2, 5, 4, 4 MMR because that is definitely a plus 100. So I have 2, 5, 4, 4 MMR. But the question is, will I get Diamond 4, Diamond 5? Let's see. Diamond 4. Come on, baby. Let's go. Diamond four. Skip the diamond five. And uh, that's the end of the episode. I hope you guys enjoyed this double promo episode and fighting one of my haters because I know you guys love it when I beat on my haters. Um, I love you guys. Thank you for watching the series so far. I hope to see you in the next episodes. Peace.